Hello, I'm just about to go to David and Heather's garden just to uh, see how those bulbs are coming up because I saw Heather earlier on and she said all these bulbs are, are starting to show and there's a bit of colour. So uh, I was actually thinking about it last night as well. It's always nice to go and revisit and, uh, and see what's happening in someone's garden that you've planted up and things that are happening. So I'm just going to go there in a minute and I'll, I'll show you what's going on. This was a fantastic project that I really enjoyed doing and uh, Dave helped me a little bit as well and, and Rick did as well so thank you to Dave and Rick for that but it looks really great all these sleeper beds at the back there we've got the, um, the wood chip and the different beds that I did with a pittosporum right at the back there this that there <laughs> and uh, lovely bamboo that kind of frames the whole garden really well so I um, planted quite a few evergreen shrubs and uh, a load of nice stuff that would attract the bees like uh, Hebe and stuff like that. But let's have a look at the uh, let's have a look at some of the bulbs and how they're doing. Oh, we've got loads of stuff coming up. Lovely, look at that. We've got crocus and uh, snowdrops, and um, we've got ah, we've got loads of daffs coming up everywhere. Look at that. Fantastic. So planted the whole area up. Well, they're coming up all over the place. There's still loads to come up. Can't wait to see them in flower. This is just a little recap for the moment. See how everything's doing. Fantastic. Look at that. So we've got daffs just absolutely everywhere and uh, the hyacinth there, they're all coming up really well. They'll produce a lovely uh, fragrance when they come up all over the place. There we go, look, excellent. Fantastic. So we've got crocus coming up as well. Um, brilliant. And look at these pansies, they're still doing really well. We haven't had a we haven't had a real heavy frost yet, so I think these are still okay. Uh, it's only January, so we'll probably still have some really cold weather, but everything at the moment is looking great. Might get a bit of a shock actually when, when the cold weather comes. And the the cyclamen are doing really well they might perish in the frost but we'll see we have a pulmonaria there which is something i try and plant in, the, in many gardens because the flowers really attract the bees and the bruna are there which i've planted in many other gardens too uh, geranium and this pittosporum which is evergreen this gives a nice bit of interest while everything else has died back in the winter and the skimmia, skimmia is doing really well. Look at that, beautiful. Mm -hmm. 